Genetics are so important because when you breed for healthier, fertile, longer lasting cows, that's just gonna give you a better ROI for the dairy in the future. I'm Craig Garretts here at Country Air Farms. We are a fourth generation farm here where we farm with my brother, my dad, two cousins and an uncle. So we're over 100 years of farming and we're gonna keep her going. I like in the breeding plan that the HHP is geared towards, which would be that moderate body size cow. That's what we've always kind of been breeding for. So when we're going through the bull selection, we really wanna make sure that teat placement and teat width are gonna align with our milking system, just a ease of attaching and going. We want a nice udder cleft. We want four udder depth. And then we like good teat placement and then feet and legs. I think that's very important with being on manure solids. Herd Health Profit Dollars is an economic-based selection index developed by select sires to try and help producers make the next generation of females that will suit the profitability of their herd. Within Herd Health Profit Dollars, there's emphasis on production, emphasis on fertility, emphasis on health traits to keep cows out of the hospital pens, as well as intermediate optimums for teat traits while also moderating stature and size for feed efficiency. Parts of HHP that are important at country are definitely mastitis resistance. With the farm knowing that they were gonna be switching to fiber solids for bedding far enough in advance, it gave us kind of a head start on being able to select for that trait. Cow longevity would mean making a calf from the start that's kind of a fixed cost, and then as she hits the herd, you have a healthy, profitable cow that's gonna make a great ROI on the dairy. Longevity is an important trait here. It's fun looking at a pen of third lactation cows that still look great. It helps us with our inventory management knowing that we have healthy cows, good genetic cows that we can use sex semen on because some of your older cows still have higher genetics than some of your younger stock. So it gives you a little more wiggle room to keep improving your genetics with all of your herd, not just with your young stock. We believe that the dairy of the future is one that needs to be very successful in both genetic investment as well as environmental management. Dairies like Country Air here are some of our favorite places to go where it's such a beautiful facility. The management team is really on top of things. The ability to breed cows that we know are going to last a long time for multiple generations helps make that genetic investment even more worth it on large successful operations. I want this farm to be thought of as we're true to our word. We do what we say. We've won the National Mastitis Council four times now, and that's gonna be one of our goals as we move forward here. Just continue what we've been doing for all these years and continue to be a top elite herd on the quality side, the culture side, and the production side. Herd Health Profit Dollars is a true economic index, factoring in not only the weightings for these PTA traits that we're trying to select for within our breeding systems, but also looking at management costs here in the dairy industry, trying to focus on the reasons that producers are spending money or making good margins on individual cow traits, and trying to make the genetic strategy align with that market environment we exist in.